Here we have a 7272 machine designed to uh, wash ink barrels, uh, heavy ink barrels. Uh, we have two 50 horsepower pumps. Uh, each pump has a timer. Uh, one pump is for washing the inner barrel, the other pump the outer part. And so you can vary the times uh, between uh, uh, washing the inside and washing the outside. Uh, each pump has a amp gauge to be able to monitor the amp pull and you can select just one pump to run or both pumps to run and uh, they're on large ABB soft starts and uh, if, if both pumps are selected there's a slight time delay so the ramp up uh, is staggered on the two pumps. Uh, looking here we have a uh, 24 hour 7 day timer for the uh, heater and skimming operation. Um, we have a filter service light uh, and a digital process controller to control the heat. Uh, we have evac uh, and then this unit also has a three horse pump uh, that does nothing but filter water and so it has its own switch here that illuminates when turned. Down here we have a manway large enough for a person to crawl into uh, to get access to the tank uh, should you ever need to go inside and service anything in there or also to assist in cleaning out. Uh, as we come on around we notice here on our evac fan we've got uh, grease zerts uh, down here easily accessible so uh, one doesn't have to climb to the top to access it. Coming on around the back a little bit further, we see the two Rosedale filters uh, and the differential switch, uh, which illuminates an indicator on the panel there when uh, filter service is necessary. On the back here, we have an access panel. And also, a secondary basket to put small parts in soaking uh, while the machine is running and it also pulls completely out of the way for another another area to clean the, the tank and access things. Uh, back here easily accessible we have the liquid control uh, probes. And coming on around uh, we have Panther Tongue Skimmer uh, that is a, a Intercomp proprietary product. On our larger units, we custom build uh, hinges uh, that's made out of inch and a half uh, coal roll and uh, bushing is push, pushed into that and we also have load bearing uh, bronze bushings so that the doors operate and move smoothly with a three-quarter bolt uh, as the hinge pin. The door operates very easily, swings easily. Inside here we also have another handle and if one needs to stand up and inspect something we have a step and access panel. Uh, inside we have swing out uh, intermediate spray bars, standard equipment, and a door switch to kill any pump uh, should the door be opened during operation by mistake. This unit has a forward and reverse on our turntable. It's also equipped with a remote control wireless unit that can be mounted on the forklift so if the forklift driver needs the turntable jogged, all he needs to do is punch the button, punch it again to stop it. box we've covered in stainless steel. 
uh, for ease of cleaning. This is a UL listed box. Inside our electrical box, here we have two Cruise A liquid level controls, uh, one for the automatic water fill, the other for the low water shutoff. This is a remote control item uh, for a turntable that we demonstrated. As you can see, we've got dedicated heaters for each uh, 18 kilowatt heater in it and white space here for more expansion uh, of whatever might be needed or desired in the future. Two amp gauges for each pump, each pump being a 50 horsepower and a selectable timer for each pump. Both pumps are selected and both are running. 